Today we're going to be talking about a topic that's important for anyone dealing with rheumatoid arthritis and that's non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs and their potential impact on our cartilage. Now we all know that non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or NSAIDs as they're also known are commonly used to manage the symptoms of rheumatoid arthritis but they can also cause some unwanted side effects. And you've probably heard about the more common side effects of NSAIDs, things such as stomach irritation, diarrhea and gastric reflux. You may also know that using NSAIDs long term can lead to more serious complications within the gut, such as the development of ulcers and also gastric bleeding. But did you also know that NSAID use can also cause damage to your cartilage and your cartilage plays an important role in protecting your joints. So I'm Dr Rachel Bailey, PhD and medical researcher here at Rheumatoid Solutions where we want you to have maximum health and minimum disease symptoms and I'm going to help you to uncover the science behind the influence of NSAID drugs on the health of our cartilage. So firstly, let's consider what our cartilage is and why it's so important. So cartilage plays a crucial role in cushioning and protecting our joints. And any damage to this vital cartilage can worsen the symptoms of rheumatoid arthritis. And this can lead to further pain and decreased mobility. So within a healthy joint, there's a delicate balance between the breakdown of cartilage and its repair. But studies have suggested that the long-term use of NSAIDs may actually interfere with the body's natural repair mechanisms. And this can upset this balance, leading to an increase in the breakdown of cartilage and its deterioration. So essentially, these drugs are hampering our body's attempts to fix itself. And according to a published systematic review, The use of NSAIDs might also interfere with the healing process of cartilage that's been damaged. And studies have shown that these drugs may actually inhibit the synthesis of protoglycans and collagen. And these are both essential components of healthy cartilage. Now for rheumatoid arthritis patients who are already dealing with the destructive effects of the disease on their joints, This additional concern makes it crucial for them to balance the benefits and the risks of using NSAIDs. Interestingly, research presented just last year suggests that anti-inflammatory drugs, which we commonly think of as helping us to deal with inflammation, might actually make inflammation in our joints worse over time. And this particular study is looking at inflammation within the knee. And in fact, within this study, regular users of NSAIDs were found to have worse cartilage quality than those who didn't use them at all. And this effect isn't just limited to those with underlying inflammatory conditions or existing knee inflammation, as we can see with this next study. Now, this study looked at a group of ultramarathon runners and explored how NSAIDs might play a surprising role in their performance. So in this study, the authors wanted to see how a common pain reliever, ibuprofen, which is an NSAID, affected the super athletes. And you would think that the ibuprofen would help to ease any post-race muscle soreness, but surprisingly, it didn't have much of an effect And in fact, the runners who took the ibuprofen actually had more inflammation markers in their body than those who didn't. So what does this mean for all of us who aren't running ultramarathons? Well, if ibuprofen has this effect on ultramarathoners who go through extreme physical stress, then it's worth us being cautious about how we use it in our daily lives. So there are many ways that we can help to reduce our pain levels. And the short-term use of NSAIDs might actually be okay if we use them from time to time. 
but just as they say on the label, they are not intended for long-term use and they may actually have a negative impact on our bodies and on our cartilage in particular. And if you find yourself relying on NSAIDs frequently for ongoing joint issues, then it might be worth exploring other pain management strategies. And there's lots of alternative approaches that you can take, such as lifestyle adjustments, joint health supplements, and these can all complement your existing pain management plan. So if you're searching for a program that includes dozens of natural and science-supported ways to reduce inflammation within your body without the side effects, then head on over to RoomTweedSolutions.com. And our comprehensive program is designed to empower you with effective strategies to manage your inflammation, enhance your joint health, and also to improve your overall well-being.